hello everyone welcome to the channel today in this video we are going to learn where to find the recycle bin in salesforce and i will explain this topic in both salesforce lighting as well as a classic interface so but before we will proceed to our today's topic there is one good news for you all so here we have launched our salesforce admin course and this course is for both expertise in salesforce as well as for the beginners also if you don't have any knowledge of a salesforce this course is specially designed for you and we will guide you for each and every concept of a salesforce admin this course consists of 9 plus modules with 21 plus or hd video and one of the biggest advantage of this course is it is a totally self paced course whenever you get a time you can watch it it's with totally one time payment of this course you will get a lifetime access and at the end of this course once you completed it you will also get the certification of completion and one more thing in this course we have covered up both lightning as well as a classic interface for each and every topic that we have in salesforce administrator we have started with the introduction to salesforce we also cover up each and everything about salesforce home page how you can edit it and how you can navigate yourself from the lightning to the classic we redirect to the user management things we let you know how you can add the users what are different licenses how you can manage these user and each and every concept of salesforce data security is also covered up we have let you know how you can restrict a user how you can restrict the object how you can restrict a field level security and even how you can control a record level security using a salesforce we doesn't stop here we have covered up each and everything about from apps to objects to tab and also we have covered up fields with different functions in the formula in both salesforce lightning as well as a classic if with the different scenarios that you get used in a real business world we have covered up advanced topic of a salesforce administration like creation of a button link section pages page layout and the list view and we also have covered the schema builder to the process builder and to make your salesforce administrator more secure we have covered up the topic of a validation rule to get a visualization of your data we covered each and every topic of a salesforce reports to a dashboard and we create this topic in both lightning as well as a classic user interface with real business examples which doesn't stop here we have one more module that covers up a data management of the bulk data if you want to deal up with the bulk data in a one go in a salesforce we have covered this topic also in which we have covered each and every concept of a data loader and how you can even create an object with the help of a spreadsheet so this course at this moment is available at a 50 percent discount from its original price so without any second thought without any waste of time just go to the description get the link of this course and go and purchase it right now it starts up your journey to the salesforce and become you a salesforce pro and you will get a expertise in salesforce administrator and with the help of this you easily get a job in a good mnc in salesforce and ah uh, and if you stuck anywhere we are here to help you out we are here to help you if you face any error or any difficulty or if you are not able to crack the interview we are here to help you and this is the course that make you a super expert in salesforce administrator so now let's move back to our topic that is where to find the recycle bin so let's proceed and firstly understand what does we mean by a recycle bin in salesforce so i hope you all are familiar with the computer world and you know when you delete a record it doesn't delete immediately from your system and it gets stored temporarily in a storage location which is known as a recycle bin in your system similarly like that in salesforce we have a recycle bin and its functionality is to store a mistakenly deleted record or a permanently 
deleted record for some time of being. In addition to this, this recycle bin feature is available for both classic as well as a lightning as I have already told you and these features are also available for different addition. If you want to get more detail about the recycle bin, you will get the link of the article in the description box. You can go through and read it out how the recycle bin works in Salesforce. Now, I am also now before we will proceed to see where it is located in Salesforce, let's uh, discuss some of the consideration that is very necessary to work with the recycle bin in Salesforce. So the record that was deleted and stored in the recycle bin, uh, stored in the format of a record name type deleted by and deleted day. And this recycle bin only stores your data for 15 days. If you don't recover your unintentional deleted data within a 15 days, it get permanently deleted from your system and you will not able to get it recover back anyhow. So I hope you have get the idea about the recycle bin. Now let's proceed and see where this recycle bin is located in Salesforce Lightning. So here I open my Salesforce account and by default I am in my Lightning interface. If you are not on the Lightning interface, make yourself to the Lightning first. The next step is to check whether that you are on a main home setup page of the Lightning that is visible on your screen right now or not. If you are not on that page, you need to click on the gear icon and from here we have a setup option. You need to click on that. It open up one new tab in your browser and the tab is similarly as the page that is look, looking on your screen right now. So here, once you reach on that page, you will get a nine dots on the left side. It is known as an app launcher. Once you click on that, these nine dots give you a search bar where you need to search for the recycle bin. And here you can see that under the item section, you will get the option of recycle bin. You need to open it once you get once I click on that, it will take me to the page where I will get the records that are deleted by me in the previous 15 days. So it is a my recycle bin page which shows me the records that I have deleted. Here we have different list view. If you want to change it to org recycle bin, you can also change it out. And if you want to change it to my recycle bin, you can do it also. And if you want to create more list view, you can also do that. We have already created videos on these things. You can go to our channel and watch this video how to create a list view in Salesforce. So with this, we have learned how where this recycle bin is located and if you want to restore anything here on the top we have a restore button you can restore the data and if you want to delete permanently the data from this recycle bin we also have a button of delete and if you want to make this uh, recycle bin empty we have an option of an empty org recycle bin also so you can do all such functionalities in the recycle bin. So with this, we have learned where it is located in Lightning. Now let's proceed and learn where the recycle bin is located in Salesforce Classic. So for this, our first step is to firstly, we need to redirect ourselves to the Classic interface. And for moving yourself to the Classic from Lightning, you need to click on your profile and here you will get an option of a switch to a Salesforce Classic. Once you click on that, it will take you to the classic interface of a Salesforce. And once you reached, you will redirect it to the home page by default. Now your next step is to scroll down yourself. And here on the left side of your home page, you will get a recycle bin option. Here you can see that under this recent item, we have a recycle bin icon. You need to click on that to get up the records that you have deleted within a 15 days so here you will get the list of records that you have deleted and here you can see that it shows you the name of the record the type of the record and who deleted the record and on which date and time this record was 
deleted so if you want to undelete it you can do that by help of undelete button if you want to make this recycle bin empty you can recycle you can empty this recycle bin by clicking on that and if you want to make the recycle bin empty of the organization for that you also have a button of empty your organization recycle bin so with this we have also learned where the recycle bin is located in salesforce classic so if you like this video click on the like button and also subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one thank you for watching and have a great day